so taking this total divided by patient in a year so then the rate cost for the patient we will get to know the expense of hospital can be broadly divided into two category one is a capital expenditure item and maintenance related expenditure higher charges means so uh, if you don't have any specific service we are getting from the outside so which is nothing but the higher charge Hello everyone, a warm welcome to one and all. I am Natesh Lachar in Commerce with the Ashram First Grade College, Mysore, the Temple of Excellence. We are in the Unit 2, Session 6, uh, Fourth Semester BCom Costing Methods and Technique. The chapter name is Process and Service Costing. In the last session, which is related to service costing, uh, the transportation related problem. Okay, and today my agenda. Under service costing, we are going for the next transportation service costing, which is nothing but after transportation, hospital costing and cost statement, the format of cost sheet or statement of the hospital. And there is one problem for the hospital costing. Uh, moving forward for the format. So here the format of the cost sheet of the hospital service sector, so which is similar to the transportation uh, operating cost okay first we will consider for the fixed uh, standing charges okay so under fixed uh, standing charges no doubt uh, if the charges are always fixed for the hospital there are number of fixed item will be considered for hospital the first one rent for the building or premises okay hospital building premises and the doctor salary also fix uh, even the general administration expense which is a fix uh, and the salary to the staff because a nurse, attender, helper, warden, everybody. So which is coming under fixed and the nurse salary. So after taking this total, okay, what we need to do. So we already calculated, we are applying the number of days, the patient day in a year. Okay. So taking this total divided by patient in a year. So then the rate cost for the patient, we will get to know. So moving to the variable cost or second category. So we call it as a running and or maintenance or variable cost. So which is keep on changes are varied. So uh, here there are few items repairs and maintenance which is coming under the variable and uh, depreciation. The cost of oxygen and x-ray or ECG which is provided to the uh, patients and the food. A food serve or food supplied which is also varied. The medicine supplied to the patients and the laundry charges okay and higher charges means so uh, if you don't have any specific service we are getting from the outside so which is nothing but the higher charge so after taking this total the total whatever we are getting total which is called total variable charges divided by again the patient's day in a year how many patients are attend divided by because we are calculating operating cost per year that's what we need to take for the denominator so now the first category fixed or standing and second category variable A plus B, then total operating cost we are getting. Okay. So again, if you directly divided patients day in a year, so the rate we will get to know. The formula is very simple. The cost per patient per day, the total operating cost divided by number of patients in a day. So here under hospital means uh, when the transportation, when we are talking related to transportation cost per kilometer or cost per passengers. So uh, at the time of hospital when we are talking, so we need to always think in the measurement like a cost unit like a per patient. So or per bed. Hospital comes under the service sector. Big company also maintain hospital. For costing purpose, the hospital service can be divided into following a category so here the first one outpatient department there are different uh, department we can see in hospital so outpatient department ward medical service department such as radiotherapy x-ray scanning okay and general service such as uh, heating uh, lighting uh, catering laundry etc and the other service such as a uh, transportation okay because ambulance okay and dispensary cleaning etc now under hospital costing the cost statement the expense of hospital can be broadly divided into two category one is a capital expenditure item 
and maintenance related expenditure okay this include salary and wages provision staff uniform cloth medical and surgical appliances and equipment fuel light and power laundry way water salary there are different persons are involved in the op operation okay or different uh, persons are involved in the hospital costing okay so we need to track uh, based on the fixed as well as variable so here there is one question for the hospital costing medicity healthcare center run a hospital it has a hired building hired building means no doubt rent we need to pay so the rent is 50000 per month okay so the medical care unit consists 25 beds the permanent staff attached to the unit are as follow without a staff so we cannot run the hospital so the staff the details the one doctor whose salary is 1 lakh per month okay because we are calculating operating cost for one year so we need to multiply with 12 so next uh, uh, two assistant each at salary 50000 per month okay each at 50000 so we need to multiply into 2 into 12 so the four nurse each salary is 30000 per month and the two helper each at salary of 15000 per month okay so because uh, two four uh, one that is numbers okay Uh, through the medical care unit is open for patient for all 365 days okay so in the uh, scrutiny the account revealed in the 2019 that only 120 days in the year the unit had the full capacity of 25 patient per day okay there are two date is given and for another 80 days it has an average 20 bed occupied for a day but 120 days 25 patients per day but 80 days only 20 beds are occupied okay moving to other information other expense for the year ended year repairs and maintenance 36000 food supply to patient uh, 60000 which is also varied or uh, variable and caretaker service 14000 laundry charges is 30000 medical supply it is 260000 varied cost of oxygen and x ray and ecg is 40000 general administration charges no doubt which is a fixed okay 160000 so apart from if the medical care unit recover an overall amount of 1500 per day on an average from the each patient what is the profit for patient made by the unit in the 2019 so immediately we need to calculate there are two date is given okay 120 as well as 80 moving for the calculation of patient in a year okay so there are 25 patient per bed is occupied so 120 days so 25 into 120 3000 we are getting okay and there is one more days is given so 80 days 20 patients are occupied bed per day for 80 if you multiply you are getting 1600 if you add together 4000 which is nothing but the total patient occupied per day in a year is a 4000 okay so moving for the there are fixed as well as variable we need to identify the fixed item so no doubt a rent of the building is 50000 is given per month into 12 if you multiply so 6 lakh is always fixed and the one doctor salary is 1 lakh okay 1 lakh into 12 so 12 lakhs you are getting there is a two assistants in the question clearly specified assistant salary also fix 50000 into 2 into 12 so 12 lakhs you are getting there is a four nurse or in a question four nurse is clearly specified nurse salary 30000 into four nurse into 12 months 14 lakh 40400 so there are two helpers clearly specified so 15000 each of them getting 15 into 2 helpers into 12 months if you do 3 lakh 60000 so general administration expense always fix uh, 
so 160000 if you take together total 49,60,000 which is nothing but the total fixed expense. So just now we calculated the total uh, patients are uh, occupied. So here the, from the total 49,60,000 divided by 4,000 if you do the cost per the fixed per patient uh, uh, 1,078.2609 moving to the variable expense of food supply to patient which is a keep on varied so 60,000 clearly specified so take care of service is 14,000 which is also varied laundry charges is 30,000 varied and the cost of medicine supplied is 260,000 varied and the repairs and maintenance uh, which is 36,000 which is varied the cost of oxygen, X-ray and ECG is 40,000. If you take together 4,40,000 we are getting. Divided by 4,600. Okay, 4,600. Easily we can get 95.6522. Okay. So, the uh, total. Now, fixed cost as well as variable cost. If you add, uh, it is nothing but the total operating cost. Uh, so, if you add together, we are getting a 54,000. From the 54,000, again, we need to divide 4,600 patients per day in a year. So, 964.2857. So, again, in the question that we collected from the patients. Uh, so, here, 4,600 uh, patients occupied uh, into 1,500, we collected each patient. So, the cost of uh, collections are 69 lakhs, okay. Now, what we need to do, from the cost of uh, how much you collected from the patient, we need to subtract the total operating cost, 54. If you subtract, you are getting 11 lakhs is a profit, okay, 11 lakhs is a profit. So, again, what we are the simple formula, operating cost per patient, uh, Total operating cost divided by total patients in a year. So, total operating cost 54 lakhs uh, divided by patient in a year. Okay. So, 4600. So, ultimately we are getting 1173.91. Again, profit per patient per day. Okay. So, here the total profit uh, divided by total patient in a year. The total profit we got 11 lakhs. Uh, divided by 4600 to 39.13 per patient per day okay we collected profit keep on watch for next session thank you